What's up, YouTube? It's your girl, Miss V, and I'm back with another small vlog for y'all. What are you doing? Nothing. I want to say hi. Sorry. Hi. Yes. Uh, Tissy. Yeah, but I'm just on here, you guys, checking in. Um, currently baking cookies. Um, I know I haven't been really making no videos for my viewers that actually watch. Even if it's just a few of you guys, three, four viewers, two viewers, somebody's watching. But y'all, I've been cool. I've been all right. Kind of been on my lazy stuff, y'all. <laughs> I don't know if it's because the weather has been cold or what, y'all. Y'all see my nails. I kind of took my nails off. The only one that's really left is my thumb. So, actually got to soak it off. But, woo. okay. Had to fix my tablecloth, y'all. My tablecloth is so pretty, y'all. And my um, my flowers I have match. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all one second. You see how the table is, y'all? You can see the white and the little. Let me see if I can show y'all a little bit. Now, you see that? Now look. Now look at my look at my flowers, y'all. I got them from a. Uh, it's decorating flowers, y'all, for my table set, but they are so cute. See, it matches. So cute, right? I like little stuff like this, y'all. Um, kind of do a little white, and it got the little stem things, the little red things, just like the ones on the table, as you can see. So cute. That's so cute, y'all, but let me put that back. I just wanted to show you guys, and of course, my... um. Because my kitchen is really just uh, red and white, really. I got the Christmas vibes going on in the kitchen. In the living room a little bit. Yeah, so it's a lot of red, white, green, uh, brownish going on in the kitchen. My kitchen. But y'all, I've been all right. I've been cool, y'all. I'm just checking in with you guys. Um, life has been okay. You know, I get hectic around the holidays time, so... Yeah, that's what that's been that's been something. Trying to holiday shop, save in the midst of having to spend. Like it's just it's been kind of crazy or whatever. But I'm blessed. I cannot complain. Ooh, my eyebrow, my eyelash. But I'm blessed. I cannot complain. I'm blessed. I'm thankful and I'm blessed. God is good all the time. But y'all, have y'all ever tried this mango smoothie? I need to finish it, y'all. It's actually watery at this point. It was thicker than this. But um, I just got in and got situated from the store or whatnot. And um, we kind of ate already while we went out, while we was out. We just got off work and everything. So it's just been a, it's been a smooth, cool, slight long day. <laughs> Oh, I'm kind of sleepy. The cold weather gets me sleepy, y'all. So, yeah, I'll probably be taking a nap in a little bit, even though it's too early. I've been going to bed early, y'all, for real. I've been going to bed early. About 6, 7-ish, 8-ish o'clock. I'm in bed. And I usually go to bed almost 10 o'clock. <laughs> like 10, 11 is when I usually go to bed. But I have 11. I don't know. But y'all, anyway, try these smoothies, y'all. They good. If you have it at McDonald's, try these smoothies. And I got a medium. These things are almost $4, though, honestly. They worth it, even though you can make your own at home. Because I love smoothies, as y'all can see. And I can make my own. But this is what I wanted when I got off work. So, I want to go get it. Because I had a headache earlier. Or whatever. And I end up... Uh, Getting a smoothie. Smoothies make me feel better. It's like it's like my evening, nighttime coffee kind of thing. Like if I'm gonna my coffee, I at least need a smoothie to make me feel a little uh, a little sugarish. I want to say probably. But I'm addicted to smoothies, y'all. I'm addicted to smoothies. For real, for real. But yeah, I've been good. I've been all right. Trying to see what to say on here because I don't know. <laughs> um, because I know it's been a little minute, y'all. I'm kind of like drowsy, sleepy, waiting on these cookies. And then we're gonna do uh, we gotta bake, 
cookies. I love uh, chocolate chunk caramel uh, some, uh, cookies bacon. And then we have the cookies and cream ice cream that we're going to put with it. So just a little dessert slash snack that we're going to eat or whatever. I try to find small things. Um, oh, I'm going to do a video with my son um, soon, probably this weekend. Cause he's so anxious to do a job, but we have uh, his gingerbread house kit that we're gonna do. We're gonna open it up, and we're gonna do a video on making it or whatever. I believe we did one a long time ago. I don't know if I saved it. I gotta go back to my old videos, but we're gonna do something like that. Um, where we do the, you know, at the kitchen table, I try to do a little crafty stuff with kids. You know, I work with kids at the end of the day, so you gotta keep busy. You know, try to do a little fun activities, but especially. I'm tongue tied, but especially around um, this time, find something to do with your kids, you know. Even if it's, you know, they, they doing e learning at home or they just, you know, quarantining, whatever, for a couple of weeks, days, whatever. Just just go out and buy them something, dollar store, Walmart, whatever. Just get a little stuff for them, like a gingerbread house. They have the snowman. They have the house. They have the gingerbread man. They have a lot of stuff, you know. And one of my favorite movies, you guys, I was watching recently with the kids is uh, the Polar. No, no, what is it called? The Polar Express Train. We was watching that, y'all. And I remember when I was a kid, we used to get on the express train. My mom and my dad used to take us. And